to the sky um, being the connecting powers in this hmm. in this process. So it, the underground stream, I didn't know enough religious symbols, but I put the ones in there that I could. And they're also up in the tree. So there's this this sensation for me, this intuition that it's all that it's all deeply connected, not only in the land but in us. And the womb room is where the vision's going to be born. Hmm. <laughs> and I don't know what that over there is. Maybe that's. I think that's partly the building actually. What is it? Oh, the red part over there? No, no, no. no, no that's, that's next somebody else. No, the this here. I think is the is a sort of an image of the building for me. What there's a door into the tree. Oh, okay. yeah. We're talking about window. this part here, right? Right. Yeah, and the window. That's the building. And the door. Lori, there's a oh, door cool. into the tree. I mean, Leslie. So yeah. it's got a lot of energy. A <laughs> lot of energy awesome. moving. And and the dark part is the center of it, from which everything emanates. It looks like. Mm-hmm. Or it's the part holding it all together. Hmm. There's a rainbow in the tree, too. There's a rainbow. That's because all, all orientations are welcome here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> cool. Left hand, right. And there's a lot of people in the trees. <laughs> there's peoples in the tree, too. And the peoples are in ones and twos and fours and hundreds. So any combination of people also is welcome here. So if anyone, if, if this drawing makes you want to say something or um, bring, sparks your imagination, feel free to. Say what it says, to, what it says to you, or what it makes you think of. I drew a, I drew a tree with a door in it too. Did you really? Yeah. yeah. Cool. Makes me think <laughs> of a hop house. <laughs> a hop it, it almost looks like an ear. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. An ear to the ground. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Cool. As long as we're standing here. Who's drawing us that and who went Well, I started that, um, and it was mostly a, um, remembering the, the gun um, club property on how they have these logging trails and then wide round uh, cutting areas. Hmm. Um, that it feels like, oh, right, that's, that's so uh, non linear and it's all nice and uh, it, it all has curves. Hmm. It's a lot more feminine. Hmm. And how. Um, I much like right, like that than, than having you know a row of houses, it's to be able to have uh, some sort of housing and then paths that connect to other hmm. clearings where they have other homes. Hmm. Um, but I didn't color it. Vienna jumped in and did that. What are the what are these? Round houses. Oh, those are. I like round houses. Okay, they're, are they yurt like? Yeah, they could be yurt like. Um, and then this is the sun above everything. Yeah, actually, the sun came before, came right after this. Because I love ravines, and I was just imagining. It lo- that looks like a toilet because I was drawing with my left hand, <laughs> and I'm right-handed. <laughs> but it's actually a chair just on the view for the sun- sunset out oh, of the ravine. Okay. And these are trees. Yeah. And there's a cool little house over here, too. Yeah, that's kind of, a, again, a, the idea of having a, with a tree growing right through the middle of the house. Oh, wow. Oh. Cool. So does anyone want to say anything about what Christian's drawing makes them think about? Cool. I like the fact that it adds sort of like a topography to the question. Hmm. Um, so whereas mine is more symbolic, I really like the, the mixture, like the imagery I have of like a potential map. Mm-hmm. And I like that. Mm-hmm. I'd like to say that I drew a tree too through my house too. <laughs> <laughs> did, you, did you draw everything that everybody did? <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> well, it's interesting that the tree goes through the house and the house is in the tree, and mm-hmm. so they're it's all, an interesting yeah, connection. Yeah, they're mm-hmm. mixed together. Mm-hmm. Cool. What do we have over here? Oh. This one over here? That's my Jerry Judd beard. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> um, Hi, Jerry. Of course, Hi, when Jerry. I first came to the mountain, Lawrence had a beard, too. It's like the big green, and then it made me think of the green man. Oh, wow. um, and the green man who lives up in the men's temple. 
Mm-hmm. Um, and there's also something about in the trees and the bare trees that feels like it's also in the beard mm-hmm. and and then, then the leaves around the beard. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, there's something about the faces in the trees and the bodies I see in the tree branches a lot. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then I had this image of, of two breasts. So I just did two great big breasts and just started going with it. And I was saying this sort of feels like a pond, like the pond in the back, um, that small pond next to the big rock. Uh, and this feels like it has something to do with the earth. Um, there's something about the way the mountain gives and gives and produces um, nurture. Um, and then the fireflies, again, around the pond. And there's often like flowers growing either in the, tr- in the uh, daffodils, I was thinking particularly in the midst of the woods, and planted around that pond. Hmm. Hmm. So. This one it, it strikes me as interesting because the... Um, the human and the natural are so interwoven mm-hmm. that yeah. they become the same thing. So it can be the face in a tree, or it can be the human um, in the middle of the woods. Mm-hmm. And that some that relationship where you can't tease them apart, I think, yeah. mm-hmm. is really important. It could be the sun too. Mm-hmm. <coughs> there was something important to me about doing a f- more feminine image and a more masculine image too. Mm-hmm. Seems to be a lot of trees around here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> trees. Is there trees in your door, too? <laughs> I'm going to stop with that or it will get really stick. <laughs> <too. I laughs> this is actually like a year off of home. There are the giant redwood homes, but they always had, um, so it's, it's a house made out of a giant tree with a, and they always had circular doors because when you go in, you're going back into the I liked the circular door. Um, wild edibles. I think just envisioning people having that direct connection from eating what's growing wild. Um, the uh, multi generational mm. aspect with the, the elders. Um, and this kind of represents the grandfather tree, mm. the grandmother trees, and then the parent trees that support them in the windstorm and the children trees. You got them mm. up. And if you pull the grandparents out, then you Parents fall. Um, the water, working with sacred wells and water. Um, garden. Um, and food, and, and then fire. Um, this is this, the coal that's being passed on. Um, and this is all kind of in the shape of, of me, <laughs> a woman. There's oh, hair, wow. there's the nose and the mouth. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Cool. And nice. this is just a really beautiful tree that has amazing lichen on it that I see every time I walk out my driveway. And this is that blueberry bush right there mm-hmm. in the eye, which reminds us to be present and in the moment. Mm-hmm. Um, What's the jellyfish? Story? All these are just brain. No, just and then one. there's one um, under the eye. Jellyfish? It's a basket. Oh, okay. It's a basket near the hands for harvesting. Oh. So really, really getting our nourishment from the land as much oh. more than than we do. Oh. And music in the oh. music needs to be in there. Cool. In the water. Huh. When you said that was you, that reminded me actually before you said what what the parts were. There's um, an Egyptian goddess, I think her name is Nut, mm-hmm. and she oh. makes the sky. Mm-hmm. Oh. She, mm-hmm. She's standing on her hands and feet, and she's arched over like this, and she makes the sky. So I was thinking that the, the person up there was making the sky. Where were these three people in the tree? <laughs> that's the, the grand, that's the elders, this is the, the parents, and that's the young oh. children. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I see a huge part of any community, any village, 